What's up? This is your boy Super, and I'm playing Elite Dangerous. Instead of buying new ships and upgrading them, I figured it's time to do an actual mission. So we're gonna try to mine. We're gonna try to mine. What we're gonna mine is methanol, hyd monohydrate crystals, and we can find those in icy asteroid belts and icy rings. So I'm gonna get. We're gonna need to up outfit my. I'm gonna need to outfit my ship. And the only mining I know of is with a mining beam, mining laser, and a refinery, and collector limpets. But I've seen people do deep core mining, and I'm not sure if you can mine asteroids with, you know, I, I'm not sure you can es explode asteroids that aren't core, when you're not core mining, when you're regular mining. So I'm gonna take, um, I'm gonna take a mining laser. An abrasion blaster and a seismic charge launcher is for deep core mining, I believe. But let's double check. Yeah, seismic charge launcher is for deep core asteroids. We're not going to do that. I think deep core asteroids and the thing I'm trying to do are the same thing. But I'm, I'm confused because the person I watched was mining for void opals and they were deep core mining. But I'm sure you can deep core mine any asteroid. So I'll take a, a subsurface displacement missile just to test it and see what we could do with that because I want, I want to explode the asteroid as opposed to just mining it with a laser but I'm not going deep core mining if you understand what I'm saying oh crap I didn't want to sell that I wanted to store that that was a good weapon oh no, that was just a seismic charge launcher I don't care about that. Or a 1B missile wreck. So we got the weapon, we got the subsurface displacement missile, which I'm hoping will explode the asteroid. The abrasion blaster, which will knock the chunks off the exploded asteroid. And the mining laser, we don't have to explode anything, we just mine from the outside. Let's see if we can do something better. A 2D mining laser as opposed to a 1D sounds perfect to me. to keep that mining laser. Never mind. Uh, oh no, I want the subsurface subsurface thing. That's right. Subsurface displacement missile. That's what we want to play around with there. There. So even if we can't explode the asteroid with the subsurface displacement missile thing, we can still mine it with the regular old mining laser. And what else do we need? I got my, my ship all eight out here. 4A, 3A, everything but the fuel tank. Let's see if we can put in, no, no, no fuel tank. Top shell and channel, so got the, All reinforcement for me. Got the cargo rack, of course. Got the refinery. Two A field scoop. Collector limpets, those are useful for mining. Prospector limpets are useful for mining. So I guess we're good to go. Change our fire groups. Uh, we'll have the beam laser all by itself. 
the abrasion blaster with the subsurface missile displacement. Okay. Well, actually, no, we can have the beam laser and the mining laser together. And then the abrasion blaster and subsurface missile displacement. And then the Olympic controllers on one by themselves, and then the scanners on one by themselves, so we're good to go. Restock. Advanced maintenance. And we're gonna need, uh, I'm gonna take 16 limpets, and we could just throw out what we don't need. Got some data to sell. Yeah. Not much though. Incoming message. Looks like we should be about good to go. Our reputation has been raised to cordial with the uh, Namahe Blue Natural Industries. Awesome. So let's Already, I'm already in the system we need to be in, so we need to find icy asteroid belt or icy rings. If you go to the second tab, it'll whatever you're hovering over, hovering over, it'll tell you what type it is: metallic, metal rich, rocky, or icy. So we got an icy asteroid belt, and all these are icy rings. And for those, you might have to scroll down to the bottom. There's, well, that one's metal rich. That one's icy. Right, right there uh, with those two little yellow, little yellow lines on the bottom it tells you what ring type is. And this system also has two earth-like worlds. Three earth, not two, two earth-like worlds. And this, let me show you where it is compared to the mission start. This is where I accepted the, the mining mission. What is wrong with my map here? Looks a little weird. That's where I accepted the mining mission. And it took, I, I took a few tries to find something with icy rat rings or asteroids in it. And so I'm right here. What's, uh, what's a little weird is uh, <clears throat> those we, how we can't get to those places down there. That's weird. I don't know how to change that either. We got no filters on, but I can't figure it out. Anyway, look, we're all good to go. Let's head on out to the icy asteroids. I forgot to select that. Went through a lot of trouble and didn't even select it. I see. Yes. Get the hell out of here. Methanol monohydrate crystals. Those are liquids, so we gotta go to I see asteroids. Collector and Prospector, good to go. Scanner, scanner, mining laser, beam laser, displacement missile, abrasion blaster. This is like, gonna be like uh, a, a, a procedure, a whole procedure with steps. We need to fire a Prospector Limpet, make sure it has what we want in it. Then if it has what we want in it, fire the subsurface displacement missile. Then use the abrasion blaster to knock off the materials and fire a prospector link it. So that's prospector one, missile two, abrasion blast three, collector limpet four. Collector limpet, that's the last thing we send out. So it's a four-step process. But I'm not even sure you can explode normal asteroids. 
I, I know you can explode core asteroids, but I've never seen people do normal ones. <laughs> I figured it would be the same process. If not, we got the regular old mining laser, so we'll be alright. explode it because that's what I've been looking forward to. I've already tried to make this video like twice. Like I was saying, you know they have this playlist in here. It would be really cool if you could add your own music to it instead of things from the codex. Like you can go to the codex right here on the first page, go to knowledge base, guardians, add to playlist. Boom, it's right there. It would be cool if we could do that with music instead of our own music. Or it doesn't even have to be our own music, it could be our own, their music. It'd still be better than flying through the space long journeys quietly. And they could put in some, uh, some MIDI music. Non-copyright MIDI music. Wouldn't be that expensive. The Guardians endured as a spacefaring civilization for at least 8,000 years before being destabilized by a lengthy civil war. The surviving Guardians were then destroyed by artificially intelligent machines of their own creation. We've all ready to buy a new ship. I got like 11 million credits. But I've already made three videos in a row about me upgrading my ship, so I figured I'd put that on hold. I'm ready to like... There's, um, I'm ready to cross the tier range. I'm low tier to mid tier luxury. So much money. Civilization was technologically superior to humans in the 33rd century and occupied an area that of roughly equivalent size. Oh, the Guardians endured as a spacefaring civilization for at least 8,000 years before being destabilized by a lengthy civil war. The surviving Guardians were destroyed by artificially intelligent machines of their own creation. The galaxy contains the world. Lithium hydroxide water. To compile a remarkably detailed Nothing good. What? What a waste of Olympic. The Guardians. Introduction. The Guardians were a non-human race that occupied a large area of space Methanol, several million years ago. Monohydrate crystals. At its height, the Guardian civilization was technologically superior. Century and occupied an area of roughly equivalent size. The Guardians endured as a spacefaring civilization for at least eight thousand years before being destabilized. Liquid oxygen, hydrogen peroxide. The surviving Guardians were then destroyed by artificial well, that's a bummer. It really is. I didn't bring much like this. Contains the ruins of dozens of Guardians. We don't find out what we're looking for. I don't know what I'm going to do with myself. Technologically uh -huh. superior to human civilization of the 33rd. <laughs> Methanol monohydrate crystals, 10%. We're here, boys. Right. Now we get on to the displacement missile. Let's see what that does. being destabilized by a lengthy civil war. The surviving guardians were then destroyed. 
by artificially intelligent machines of their own creation. Placement missile firing in three, two, one. And data logs recovered from these sites have allowed humanity to compile a remarkably detailed picture of Guardian society. Placement missile firing in three, two, one. The Guardians. Introduction. The Guardians were a non-human race that occupied a large area of space I guess I was wrong. several million years ago. At its height, the Guardian civilization was technologically superior to human civilization of the 33rd century and occupied an area of roughly equivalent size. The Guardians endured as a spacefaring civilization for at least 8,000 years before being destabilized. Because we're sticking to just the regular old mining laser. The were then destroyed by artificially intelligent machines okay, of their own creation. Get the collector the limpet out there along with the, the cargo skills. Dozens of Guardian settlements and data logs <laughs> recovered from these sites have allowed humanity to compile a remarkably detailed picture of Guardian cool. society. The Guardians. Introduction. The Guardians were a non-human race that occupied a large area of space. Stuck with the regular mining lasers, but at least it'll be a mission complete. Was technologically superior to human civilization of the 33rd century and occupied an area of roughly equivalent size. The Guardians endured a space-faring civilization for at least 8,000 years before being destabilized Let's see what we got in here. The surviving Guardians were then destroyed by Method artificial machines of their own. Population. I got a nice refiner. The galaxy contains the ruins of dozens of Guardian settlements, and data logs recovered from these sites have allowed humanity to compile a remarkably detailed picture of Guardian society. There's a lot of things coming up this asteroid. Fast too. I'm gonna leave, drop another click to one put out there. The Guardian civilization was technologically superior to human civilization of the 33rd century and occupied an area of roughly equivalent size. The Guardians right. endured as a spacefaring civilization for at least 8,000 years before being destabilized by the out there. The surviving Guardians were then destroyed by artificially intelligent machines of their own creation. The Why galaxy isn't that working? contains I don't know. Of dozens of Guardian settlements, and data logs recovered from these sites have allowed humanity to compile a remarkably detailed picture of Guardian society. The Guardians. Method all monohydrate crystals are refined. Oh crap. Don't go. Human civilization of the 33rd century and occupied an area of roughly equivalent size. The Guardians endured as a spacefaring civilization for at least 8,000 years before being destabilized by a lengthy civil war. The surviving Guardians were then destroyed by artificially intelligent machines. Liquid oxygen, water, methan methanol, monohydrate crystals. Of Guardian settlements. It's like we only got one or need four. Have allowed humanity to compile a remarkably detailed picture of Guardian society. The Guardians. Introduction. The Guardians were a non human race that occupied a large area of space several million years ago. Turn it point, off. The Guardian civilization was technologically superior to human civilization of the 30th century. I don't know century. how I got on repeat it anyway. an area of roughly equivalent size. Not fire another collector and put out. I know you can do more than one at a time. I think. I don't really know, but I don't see a reason why not. I started depleted, you say? No, so. We'll have three units, maybe. No, probably two and a half. Cross 
to this asteroid. Fire prospect a little bit. Hydroxide, water, and that's it. On to the next one. Let's say prospector fails and then proceed to work. Mm -hmm. Liquid oxygen, hydrogen peroxide. I think it means the last prospector limpet stops prospecting. Because I got a new one out. So what have, have I been to this place? I guess I will take this off. I think it goes to uh, not your cargo, but your mater mats, materials. So I'll take it. So I was worried about space, but not if it goes there. I'm gonna have to hit the rock to get this bad boy. Prospect or See what's up with this rock. Damn, wasted Olympic. Is there like a way to get those back or something, right? Why do they just hang out like that? I'm wasting all my limpets now. Is there a way like I could like I could shoot the asteroid and tell me if it was depleted? Hydrogen peroxide, methane caltrate. Let's try one more, see what happens. Tritium hydrogen peroxide, okay, well, we're not gonna you know, mess with that one then. That's the one that was depleted. 
that's the one I was, yeah, that's the one I was just at, obviously. Okay, now we're in the right direction. What is this? There's something over here, what is it? Weak scan. High wake, I mean. Weak scan. What's wrong with me? Bummer. Let's go ahead and fire a prospect for them at this point. Liquid oxygen, hydrogen peroxide. No, thank you. this time. And we might have to hop over to the ring instead of the bell and see what's up there. Water lithium hydroxide again. Water lithium hydroxide, lithium hydroxide water. That's all it is, huh? Alright. Let's check our inventory here. 84% from that way. We have 84% of what we're looking for. And then we'll have three, so we're nowhere near where we need to be. Try to go scoop up. Oh. And we we'll head on to the ringed planets. I see ring here, so let's go. Check that one. Since it's on the way. It's depleted, okay. We're leaving. Going to Namihe, Namihe V1. I'm disappointed if we didn't get to explode on anything. <laughs> I'm gonna figure out how to do that one of these days. So, let's see how much money we can get from this stuff. 2400 for the mission items. Disappointing. What's the reward for it? 150,000? That's nothing. I can't even pay my rebuy. See, I need to get a new ship where you can have like the 4A refinery, 4A cargo scoop, all of the mining tools, instead of swapping modules out all the time. Yeah, this 
see, look. 12 million credits, my revised 490,000. What am I supposed to do with 150,000 credit reward? Namihi V1, Namihi, Namihi, that's my awesome name, Namihi. Name, good name for a girl, Namihi. Hey, Namihi, come here, let me talk to you, Namihi. You're a little cutie, Namihi. to stop because I need to get into the ring. Is there a resource extraction zone around here? Yeah. But the threat level is quite high and I'm carrying valuable cargo. So... I guess I'll have to risk it. Exactly, limpids, that's what. So I know we got the methanol, monohydrate crystals, and limpids. Hope we don't get interdicted. Destroy. Destroy the asteroid. Limpets go. Uh oh, we're getting ship scanned. Water, liquid oxygen, methane, cultrate. See that, guys? He says, I don't got a problem with you. You have nothing I want. Awesome.
And so we got an authority ship out here to protect us, huh? So that sounded like said uh incident response units on station. Crimes investigating crimes reported. Tritium, and that's it. Just gonna waste all, I don't wanna waste all my limpets. So we're just gonna have to shoot them and see what falls out. All citizens must submit to authority scans. Do not attempt to flee. All citizens must to. See what falls out. Huh? I thought we were going to be professional. Got no range on this mining laser. What do we got? Methane caltrate lithium hydroxide. Let's give it another try. What do we got? Nothing caltrate and liquid oxygen. All right, let's mosey on down this way. Let's mosey on down this way. We're gonna need those limpets to be collectors instead of prospectors. So, don't know what to tell the game. Crime scene, cordon removed, go back about your business. Crime scene, crime response team in situ, security sweep and scan commencing. What's coming off this asteroid? Mm -hmm. Looks like the same as the other one, or lithium. Bunch of weird stuff. Yeah, tritium's on this one. That's what this one is, tritium. Methanol monohydrate crystals. I'm just having a terrible time trying to talk tonight. Oh, but that came out perfect. And it was an alliteration. Terrible time trying to talk tonight. Oh, crap. Oh, carbon is pure. So we're getting a lot of methane, methanol monohydrate crystals from this one. I think we'll be done. That's a ton of them. Do you see that? We got to reallocate stuff here. Got three and... Get rid right of. We got enough space, so we'll just wait it out. Wait it out. I might just end up filling up my inventory on this one before I turn into mission. We'll see. I think it's been a good video, besides from my mistakes and not knowing how to explode the asteroids. I don't care. Look at this. Look at all that. That's all our mission 
what we're here for. It's like two pages of it. That big, big ass paragraph, and this big ass paragraph. I see the asteroids are so much better than Rocky went. It's still three though. Collect the one going slow. Let me see if I can put on another one. No, I won't let me. I don't know why. There's a lot of stuff coming off this asteroid, you have to admit. Sure can't say no man's cat, I mean, sure can't say this game is boring. So there we go, we got our four, now we're just gonna let our limpid collect all everything that's out here. And then head on back to turn it in. Quite a few things out here still. Quite a few things. I'm really, I'm, I'm glad to see this carbon, iron, phosphorus, and iron. Uh, I'd like to take a look at how much materials I have right now. About 10 of everything almost. A couple things with 30, 60, a couple things with 3. Got quite a few though. Maybe like 4 pages. <clears throat> it's cool how they don't take up your cargo hole. There we go, now we're under fire. on the one paragraph. things. Yeah, oh, we should, maybe we should help with the, uh, the pirates or whatever over here. Collection targets, all right, we're out of here. Let's see if we can take down one of these pirates. Over Mark Three, where you at? Oh, he's a master, but he's clean too, so we don't have to do that one. Let's go with the Sidewinder, that's a nice, easy target. in the starter ship. 
He's an expert. He's clean. So wherever they were going after, drop some mines. Alright, well let's go. Shop market. Enter under. There she be. Hopefully, we can get this video done in just under 50 minutes. They tell all the new YouTubers to keep your videos short. Because more people like to watch short videos. Because everybody's busy in their day to day life. But you gotta make them longer than 10 minutes if you want them to be monetized. I just started and I know that. So that's why if you see like YouTubers, with all their videos are like 15 minutes, 10 minutes. So it's just enough to get monetized. I'd love to be monetized, but I'm sure there's good things that come along with being a YouTuber, even if you don't get monetized, you know. Like, people that party all the time, there's things that come along with partying that, that are cool, you know. Like, the people you meet, connections, things like that. Under sounds like a Pokemon. Uh, I'm, on, I'm on a PS5 right now. This is a PS4 game. I'm playing the PS5, so it only lets you record 60 minute videos, so that's why I'm, I try to keep it low, keep it short. Fresh up, Marky, here we come. I'm having a terrible time trying to talk tonight. Funny how everything I said came out wrong, but that came out perfect. figure out how to explode the asteroids and well I really want to learn everything there is to know about mining but I'm disappointed I didn't get to get get in there and get things done and figure it out and I want to get to the engineers And the, uh, the passenger, passenger cabin, putting cabins in your ship, transport thing seems kind of interesting, but not as much as the mining or the engineers. I plan to make uh, videos about all, all my experience with the game. Like, this is my, my own, my first and my only playthrough that I'm recording. Victor for approach to land. 
landing pad 1-2. Automated docking assist is now in progress. Fitting, then back out so you don't have to sit and watch that loading screen. And the next time you go to outfitting, you'll be already there. Little pro tip for you 153,000, which isn't that anything. Check on Universal Cartographics. Sure thing, I'll sell it. I'll sell it again, sure. I'll even sell it again. Don't need to go to contacts. Well, we have extra we can sell. I believe, yep, two extra. All profit. Not very much, but profit. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a basic mining mission on Elite Dangerous. Thanks for watching, and if you could help me out, it would help me out if you could like and subscribe. Thanks.